Hello lads and lassies, welcome back to my channel, it's Hi Mr Mayhem. Today, I'll be doing a tier list for the Doom games and some of the DLC. Now there's a couple of things in here that I've not played. Um, for instance, I've not played, I believe these are the expansions. Um, but I've played everything else. I'm assuming this is, one of these is Doom 64 and one of them is Doom, so we'll go off of that. So, um, But before we get into it, if you do enjoy this, remember to leave a like, drop a comment, subscribe for more. You can support me on Patreon, follow me on Instagram and Twitter, links in the description. Let's just get into it. So, starting off... Uh, the first Doom, um, I understand it is revolutionary, it is what created the FPS. Um, I actually think it's quite fun still these days, I mean, I know a lot of people are like, oh duh, well, but um, bear in mind that, you know, I it wasn't my fr first FPS, far, far, far from it, but I played through it a couple of years ago on my Switch and it's awesome, um, it's still really, really good. It does get tedious with how many levels there are, but it's still good, so I'd probably put it, I'm going to put it in A tier. Um, Doom 64, probably the same, um, like, it's Doom, and it's awesome, and it's really cool, because there's, like, different kinds of weapons, it's a completely different game to Doom, which is still really cool, I played that, um, when Doom Eternal came out, because you got a free code for that, um, so that was awesome, but I really, I, I really enjoyed Doom 64 as well, I also bought up my Switch and played through it on there as well, so, really, really did enjoy Doom 64. Uh, Doom 2, um, and much and such the same, it's like, it's just more Doom. I guess I'd actually put it in B tier because it just feels like more Doom. But I got tired of that, so I'd probably just put it in B tier, I would say. Um, you notice I don't have much to say about these games because I've not played them much, like, as in, and there's not much to say that hasn't already been said. Uh, Doom 3, honestly... I think it's A tier. I really, really enjoyed my time with Doom 2. I've played through it twice. Once on 360, once on Switch. I loved it. Like, do you know what? Actually, I'm going to put an S tier. Because I actually really, really enjoyed it for what it was. The slower pace, I actually really liked it. Um, and I also agree with G-Man Lives that it is... There's not a bad Doom game. and It's actually one of my favourites. It's really, really good. I enjoy the, the slower pace. I understand it's not for everyone and that everyone was annoyed because it's not fast pace, etc. But I actually really, really enjoyed my time with it. So much so that I played through it twice, and yeah. It's just really, really good. Uh, I would recommend it if you have not played it. Um, uh, the expansion pack, probably an A. I got frustrated with it, um, but I st it's still more Doom 3, and I fucking love Doom 3, so yeah. Uh, Doom 2016, I mean, it's S tier. I mean, it, it just is, like, the fast-paced combat, the graphics, the score. The soundtrack, Mick Gordon, Daddy Mick Gordon, Mwah, beautiful. Um, yeah, it's just S tier shit. Um, I actually quite enjoyed the mo the multiplayer for what it was. I know I know a lot of people didn't, but I really did enjoy it, and I still think it slaps to this day. I just got finished playing through it uh, a couple days ago, so yeah, it just slaps. Uh, I mean, Doom Doom Eternal is my favorite by a country mile. Doom Eternal is my favorite. Um, I absolutely adore Doom Eternal. I've bought it on uh, Xbox, PlayStation, Switch, PC. Like, oh, it's incredible. And I'm doing a playthrough of Eternal right now for the channel. Um, so you guys will probably see that next month. I believe this is going to come out in June. So you guys will see that next month. But, oh, it's fucking brilliant. I love it. The score, the gameplay is vastly improved from 2016. There's so much moving parts that it's easy to learn, difficult to master. It's honestly just an incredible game that... It's so upsetting to see the stuff that happened behind the scenes with Mick Gordon and everything and that he didn't get to finish the soundtrack properly. But honestly, I love it. It slaps and that's why I got the collector's edition. Like, well, I pre ordered it. I didn't know it was gonna be good, but nah, it's my favourite Doom. It is it just slaps. It's so, so, so good. And now for the DLC. Ancient Gods Part One kicked my fucking ass. And I didn't enjoy it as much as the No. Did I? I'm just trying to think, though, like... Because it's just more Doom Eternal, just harder. So I probably would put it... I'd probably put it, like, below Doom 2016, but above Doom 3. Um, Ancient Gods Part 1 is fucking hard. If you've never played Ancient Gods Part 1, it's ridiculously hard. Um, but it's really, really good. And Ancient Gods Part 2, I don't think I've... Have I finished that? No, 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 I have. I did finish it once. Um, and that was probably, like... 
down here i didn't really it's s tier as well i just didn't i didn't really enjoy um some aspects of it but i really loved others and it's just more doom eternal as well so that's instantly an s tier just depends on where it goes um yeah this is this has been quite a short video i mean it's my tier list for the games i don't really have much else to say but uh, i've not played the two expansions for doom 2 that's what i believe they are um if they're not please do correct me in the comments um but yeah overall doom slaps and i will be doing a playthrough of ancient gods part one and two for the channel at some point um but right now you guys should be in the middle of the doom 2016 playthrough i believe so i hope you are enjoying that but yeah that's been my ranking of the doom series i know i'm gonna get a lot of flack for the original and the sequel but it's my opinion like i said if you want to criticize it that's fine but to me doom eternal is peak doom so yeah um, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, if you do enjoy this, remember to leave a like, drop a comment, subscribe for more, support me on Patreon, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, links in the description, and I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.